you've spent hours slash days slash weeks recording, mixing and tweaking your latest GarageBand for iOS track to perfection. What next? Well, if you want to share the project view of your magnum opus in a group, forum or whatever in video form, you're going to need to master screen recording. In this quick tip, I'll show you how. iOS has a built-in screen recorder that's pretty straightforward to use. As of iOS 13 slash iPadOS, this screen recorder records and outputs audio in stereo. If you're running an older version of iOS, you can still follow along with the instructions in this video, but the audio of your captured video will be in mono, not stereo. So bear that in mind. What we're going to do here is add the screen recording function to your iDevices control center. Control center is the settings and controls that appear when you swipe down from the top right corner of your screen in iOS. Okay, first thing to do is head to your iDevices settings menu. Then tap on control center and tap again on customize controls. The list at the top here are the controls that currently appear in your control center. The list below that is the list of controls that can be added to control center. You'll see screen recording here. Tap the green plus icon next to it and it will be added to the list at the top. Now, when you're ready to record your GarageBand project video, just swipe down from the top right of your screen to access control center, tap the screen record icon, wait for the countdown and then your screen will be recorded. When you're done, reopen Control Center and tap again on the screen recorder icon. Your captured video will save to your Photos app. You can now share it as you wish. That'll about do it for this quick tip. I've been Patrick from thegaragebandguide.com. Bye for now. <laughs>